Hey y'all, welcome back to Aries Routines. Let's get undressed and hop into the shower for our strawberry scented shower routine. Now I'm starting off with washed hair or conditioned hair um, because my shampoo and conditioner are not strawberry scented so it kind of jumped ahead. Now I know strawberry is a summer scent but we're pulling it into fall because this was pre-recorded. <laughs> I have been going through a lot. I actually just got over COVID. I am healthy though, so I have no complaints, but I did have a lot going on. So it's a little late, but who doesn't like smelling like strawberries? So while I'm combing out my hair, I'll give you all a little preview of what's coming up. I do have my nighttime, or I believe it's my like relaxing bath routine and first date routine plus size edition we'll see so y'all for this routine we're going to actually be triple cleansing i'm going in with the body shops strawberry bar soap it smells really good it has a hint of that organic smell so if you've ever smelled pacifica brand it has that little hint of dirt i don't know how else to explain it <laughs> next is the olay i believe it's white strawberry body wash smells amazing like one of my favorite body washes for summer or just to smell like fruit smells great highly recommend <laughs> like highly recommend it's actually one of my favorite body washes but we're going in we're going to suds up and get all nice and clean you can really stop here if you would like as far as cleansers go but i'm going to be extra Next, I'm going in with a Tree Hut Sugar Scrub. You know I love a Tree Hut Scrub, y'all. And this one smells good. Maybe not my favorite, but it does smell good and it paired well with the Olay um, Body Wash. So y'all know I like to be extra. <laughs> so I'm finishing off um, with the Body Shop Strawberry Shower Gel for my final cleanse and my exfoliation gloves. I am using the exfoliation gloves on my very stubborn areas. So areas I have KP, which are the back of my arms and the back of my thighs. I think they help, um, but I've noticed the, like the best results from moisturizing very well. This smells like Hubba Bubba strawberry gum. It smells really good, but I would still choose the Olay over this one. Y'all know the vibes of VH Essentials Feminine Wash with a rag. I'm only using a rag this time because I was on my period at the time of the video. Um, so I like to specifically use a white rag to get everything clean and I make sure that I can see that there's no leftover you know bleeding or residue or anything of that nature i'm also rinsing out my hair and i will be using strawberry products as for my leave-in that i'll show in a minute so we're gonna go in with the raw sugar it is for kids i know but it's a leave-in conditioner my hair um is kind of easy it takes well to new products and like it it doesn't really mind um highly fragranced things um so if you have a texture like mine this will be fine for your hair did it lock in the most moisture no but it, it worked <laughs> so y'all know again an og on this channel is the shea moisture's body oil um i'm trying to do it every all of my moisturizing at least one step on damp skin it just really locks in the moisture so i love to see it we're gonna grab our towel and we're gonna head out to our after shower portion of this routine so i'm just gonna wrap my hair up in my old ass microfiber towel <laughs> um i do still have that leave-in on my hair it's super lightweight and it smells great um, after that, I'm going to sh show you <laughs> and demonstrate the Cora reusable disc. I have a slight review. So while it's boiling, because yes, you do have to boil it. I will give you my review. So yes, y'all, I did say boil. You do have to boil it in between each month. Um, so I can use it for six days and then my next month cycle, I will have to reboil it to sanitize it. 
So honest review. I hated it the first time I used it. The first month, I honestly gave it a try. I've used multiple discs in the past. So this is not my first time, but I really did not like it. It is like a silicone based material, which makes it hard to slide in and out if you don't have a heavy flow. Um, so keep that in mind. I don't know if they sell like a lube or anything like that specifically for it. Um, but that was my one main thing that I didn't like. The second main thing was I couldn't get it positioned correctly so it didn't leak. Um, I've, again, used discs in the past where I've never had this issue. So it was a learning curve. Um, the second month I used it, it was a lot better. Um, TMI, I learned that your vagina has to have blood. You can't just wipe with toilet paper and it be dry down there and then try and put it in because it doesn't work like that and it will hurt. Um, so just keeping that in mind in between uses. So I you wear mine like from eight to eight to eight to eight or so something like that. Um, so 12 hours, I take it out. I wash it with antibacterial soap and pH balance soap. They do sell their own soap. I have not used it, so I can't attest for it. Um, here I am just washing my hands. Of course, you do want to wash your hands before you touch anything that inserts your body. So I'm washing my hands really good with antibacterial soap. I am then going to take the actual disc and wash with antibacterial soap as well. And um, my VH Essentials Feminine Wash that I use on a daily. Um, that has worked for me. I, it has not, excuse me, has not caused me any um, infections or that I know of. So I haven't gotten a yeast infection or um, BV or anything like that. Um, because I am typically using the pH balance soap on my vagina, I think that may, you know, help. Um, which I actually have switched up. So I will have to update my like vaginal care or feminine hygiene routine um, because I have switched up this soap, y'all. <laughs> I didn't say that earlier, but I have. Um, and so we're really washing it and rinsing it. This is after it's been sanitized and boiled. Um, and then I'm just gonna put it to the side to air dry on a clean paper towel. I don't recommend any towels because again, the material it is, it actually picks up lint, so a clean paper towel. Okay, we back and I'm brushing my teeth because I actually have somewhere to go. Um, I will have a dental hygiene routine out soon, so stay tuned for that. For lotion, I am using the Strawberry Body Yogurt by The Body Shop. Y'all, don't recommend, don't buy it, please. <laughs> it is probably one of the worst lotions I've ever used. It's like a glaze, it ends up sticky, it, but it smells good, I'll give it that. I'm using the Secrets Berry Scented Gel Deodorant. I'm not a fan of gel deodorants, but it smelled so good, so I had to buy it. My armpits are hairy. Judge your mama, don't judge me. I had to wax, so I was in the process of growing them out. Mind your business. How about that? Okay, for perfumes, I'm using the Body Shop Strawberry Perfume and sugar berry by good chemistry i believe i got it at target these combined will have y'all smelling like a snack you will be smelling so good not for very long because they don't last <laughs> but you will be smelling good um like if you wanted to go to bed like this is a good nighttime um scent just kind of light but it smells amazing and i like smelling like a snack for my hair, I'm going back in with the Raw Sugar Kids Strawberry um, Detangular. Detangular? I think I'm saying that right. Um, just to wet up my edges again uh, because they were getting a little frizzy and I didn't like that. Right now, I only have the Raw Sugar um, Leave-In on my hair. So you can kind of see the definition I got from that. Not much, but you know. Um, I put my hair back up in a clip and I'm using this um, strawberry scented edge control. Y'all can really skip this step because it ended up looking real stupid. <laughs> I can admit when I do stupid stuff, like it didn't make sense for me to do my edges because it ended up not doing right. It was just a mess. But y'all see, y'all catch my drift. I was going to my parents' house, so it really didn't matter, but... I wanted it to smell good. <laughs> if 
final touches y'all know we always moisturize our lips this is the strawberry lip balm by the body shop i actually re recommend this y'all I, I do recommend this it, it tastes and smells and have my lips moisturized <laughs> all right y'all bye